Well, a church that has been a staple in the Charlotte community for a hundred years caught fire, forcing leaders to close its doors. Take a look. You can see the damage to the steeple and the roof at the United House of Prayer for all people in Northwest Charlotte. Channel 9's Anthony Castora has been following every development since the fire started overnight. Now he's taking a closer look at the damage and the cause. The doors are already locked while the congregation temporarily relocates, not just from the fire on the outside, but from the water damage on the inside. Investigators are blaming faulty wiring for this early morning fire at the United House of Prayer in Northwest Charlotte off Beatty's Ford Road. They were trying to illuminate these crosses in the steeple when the fire broke out. A passerby noticed the flames and plumes of smoke and called 911 immediately. Firefighters put it out within minutes. Put tarps down across a lot of the, uh, uh, the, uh, the pews and other stuff inside to protect it from water damage. Even with their quick thinking to prevent more destruction in the historic church, they now have to close because of the $40,000 in damage left behind, mostly from all that water. Keep the faith and everything's happens for a reason. Neighbor Roosevelt Rubin says the church has one of Charlotte's largest religious denominations spread across five locations in the Queen City. It's known for its community outreach and its cafeteria offering lunch in the city. It just celebrated 100 years earlier this month. And he's confident they'll bounce back in no time. And I think uh, our failure is just a setup for God to, you know, to do something better. While the congregation is forced out of this location here in Northwest Charlotte, the other locations here in town are helping them while they get back on their feet. Back to you.